the concept of da as an active ingredient of sun is so incredibly powerful and so incredibly creational because of the idea that it has nothing that comes before it and nothing that comes after it. Indeed, love. When you invoke love within the self, as you have been practicing and as you have been doing for most of your natural lives, of course, then you know that you activate within yourself, you tap within yourself into something that is undefinable, but that has nothing that came before it, that has nothing that comes after it, merely because it has no beginning and it has no end. It is not created from the concept of mind. In fact, the concept of mind itself is created through Da as one of the building blocks. So from that perspective, Da is, of course, the original and initial active ingredient in Sun. And we have spoken a great deal about expressing Da and experiencing Da as it turns into Imzaya, as it turns into something closer to the concept of love that you know on this planet today. The next active ingredient, Ba in English, translates as joy. Now, joy is much like love, unfortunately, these days, a much misunderstood word. Joy and any of these expressions are often tied into or related to uh, the senses or to the, uh, the emotional range, which is a mental state. So when people think of joy, they often think of excitement. They think of happiness. They think of the state of joy that comes when an external object or an external person or an external event causes a scenario to unfold that brings with it a sense of happiness. These are not uncommon and they come with a state of excitement. Many people also, of course, by merely having a thought a thought about a future event or a thought about a past event or a thought about an event or a situation in the now. This too can bring a state of happiness, a state of excitement and even a state of peace. But this is not the joy that we refer to. You have been taught already uh, in 2006 or 2007 perhaps that the difference between a chakra-based state or a mental state and a chakra-based state is the fact that in the state, for instance, of excitement, happiness, which is a chakra mental-based state, a patterning occurs, which triggers a frequential and vibrational state. Now, much like Da, Ba has no vibrational state, therefore it can have no frequential state, and it can certainly not live within the range of the emotional or the mental. In that, it differs greatly. In fact, most of the material that is uh, taught by Ascended Life here in uh, Imzaya world differs greatly from anything that you can experience in the exterior world because the exterior world is not 
what the study of the Pa is trying to describe. But many people, many students enter into some form of conflict because they believe that then the study of the Pa or the Sun elements must be trying to describe the inner world. And while it is so, that throughout the study of vibration, the inner world is often referred to. You probably have already touched upon the fact that the inner world is also not what we are truly describing. And Ba, the state of joy, helps the student to understand this. Like Da, has nothing that comes before it or after it. Ba, the state of joy, has nothing that is within it or nothing that is without it. It has nothing on the inside of itself and it has nothing on the outside of itself. I am certain that you have experienced these states of joy before. The problem, however, is that the human mind is not necessarily up to par when it comes to easily helping you to remember these states. They exist in a way outside of, of the realm of your thoughts and the realm of your memories. Memories which are always designed to tap into a past moment or to start generating a future moment. But these states, the state of Da and Ba, exist outside of that range. So therefore, when you do consciously tap into them, the result is an infinite remembrance. It feels and truthfully so, that in that moment, that state of Da or that state of Ba has always been there, fills your entire being, and that your being has never been anything else. Your expression has never been anything else. Your world expressed around you has never been anything else but that.